So, we finally got the floor dry in the garage, which took a really long time. I'm still waiting for the floor to dry. It's been over 24 hours now. But PVA sometimes dries slowly, it would seem. Because the floor was wet and I couldn't get into the garage, I had to try and fit a toilet seat with just my bike toolbox. So, not your usual tools, but we'll see. The challenge is to fit the toilet seat with my bike tools, as the other tools are in the garage. And the floor's still drying. Isn't that a good challenge? I don't know if I'm going to be able to say that. All I need is a posi drive, I think. Uh, and so we were able to start filling it with things, so here goes. Ding the garage out. This is my side. That's Andrew's side. Hmm. Christmas morning, maybe. Never been so excited about a dry floor before. So the idea now is, I didn't like the fact that it was twisting, like it would be like that. I just didn't want to twist the joist really, so I'm going to cut that off, mount it in there like that, and then mount the wood square onto the bottom of the joist. Uh, hacksaw. <laughs> What's wrong with the cheese? Try. Is it mouldy? No, I'm eating it, so how could it be mouldy? Mm. <laughs> Noise. No. 25 mil, that will bang in quite nicely. Oh, it's like it was made for it, look. So we've started to fill the garage full of stuff, haven't we, Lucy? Yeah. <laughs> Mine half and your half. I don't think so. And you and I'll do a little tiny pathway that you can go through. No. Uh, Ooh, this is slippy, though, this floor. We've installed the temporary pull-up bar. It's very good now. Now the floor's sealed. Bike area, which will be 